Good day, Zero Kids. We are back with another Deccan fight, and today we're going to be checking out the, I think, the only remaining deck from the set that I have not covered yet, um, which is, of course, you know, the current set that Global is on, I believe. You know, so you guys got your, like, Overlord and a bunch of other stuff, and you got your Aqua Forces and your gold pal never mind i haven't done gold paladin or angel feather yet i lied i lied i lied i will do them eventually angels um i don't want to play the zero damage version so i haven't touched that one yet and gurgrit i just i don't i don't i don't play gurgrit too much even though i own the cards but today we're gonna take a look at the other deck that we haven't done yet from this set which of course is aqua force so aqua force is pretty cool it got some really cool new cards and i think it's pretty funny to do big multi tech with big numbers and win so our new grade 3 is the big seaman himself, Savas Tavas. So he has a couple effects. First, he says rear guard circle. Oh my god. GB2, wave 1 or 4. Once per turn, at the end of the battle that he attacked, counterblast 1 and stand him. And he has a vanguard circle effect. Uh, when you stride over him, you can call a card from hand, and until the end of the next turn, give one rear guard resist. So that's really cool because you basically play a bunch of cards that have resist, and you also give resist to your other rear. So that's why people call this deck Resist Force. So yeah, give a resist, and for that turn, that unit can attack. Um, uh, if that unit has the wave ability, that unit can attack from the back row, and um, when you ride this guy, he gets plus 3k. So it's pretty good. The attack from back row is also like really, really nifty. So definitely very nice. Just be careful when attacking with him as a rear guard that when you want to restand him before using his own restand effect, you attack with him on the second or third attack. So you want to swing with one rear, then him, then swing with your stride that restands him, and then use him on the fourth attack to restand. So very important. We still play one copy of the old Tavas just to like have it. But then we're actually running Benedict. So Benedict, you might be thinking, what the hell, bro? Why are you playing Benedict again? Well, this thing is. Is just at the end of the battle, attack the vanguard, restand after losing 5k. But it doesn't matter because our best stride ever, Mr. Alexandros, makes much more power than that. So, Alexandros is a stride that literally makes Aqua Force scale like insanity right now. So, he says, when uh, wave two or three at the end of the battle, attack the vanguard, you can almost one and flip a unit face up and then choose two of your rearguards and stand them. And for that turn, for every face up card in your G zone, those stood units get plus 5k. Just one simple effect, but that's all you really need because you swing rear, swing rear, swing this, restand two rears that restand by their own abilities. So you basically get yourself seven attacks without really breaking a sweat because you basically go one, two, three, and then four, five, six, seven, and um, you know, your opponent just kind of folds that because the number scales. That's why we need three copies because you go into him every single stride. Two can, you can get by with two, but honestly, I would recommend three. Um, you can cut some Lambroses if you don't have four. This is just like a backup, basically. Um, and then, of course, we have the Wailing Vavas for that removal slash, um, you know, mostly removal option. And then the back row scaling power attack with the Commander Thawas as well, if you ever need it. So that's the grade threes and the grade fours. Going into the grade twos, we have a new friend, which is the Shipra. Shipra says on both players' turns, if your Vanguard is a Thawas, she gets plus 2k and resist. So she's 11k with resist, which is pretty nice. And with GB1 on second through fourth battle wave, uh, when she attacks the Vanguard, if your Vanguard is a Thawas, can almost one, draw one, get 3k. So get some nice numbers in there too. Four title assault because we need it for our main stride because it scales really really well uh some algos just to help draw cards and then a couple copies of uh adelaide because while she is a bit more resource heavy than the other restanders she's also a good restander too and then finally for the great ones we are playing uh the tactical tactics sailor for the draw power just to find more pieces and one copy of melania this can be virtually anything it's just a resist piece so just trying to play some more resists which is also nice so I recommend the deck quite a bit. We do run Eric as a starter because like you really have to hit this <laughs> as your grade three to ride. Otherwise you'll be searching it out with your Nikki. So that is the main point to know for the actual main deck lineup. So let's get into some games and see how we do. Having a lot of resist is pretty nice. 
Um, and yeah, some people do run more resists rather than running the tactics, but I think it's fine to um, have the tactics in there just to make sure you're drawing into your pieces. So let's see what we get matched into, what kind of decks we have that we can resist against and uh, have a good time. All right, Neonectar, not going to be resisting much here. We're going to be trying to push hard. Going second especially, this means that we have the big, strong push and we have the right great. Oh my God, look at this. Look at this hand, dude. Oh my god. I might as well keep the whole thing. I'm gonna ride this and call this later and just like... If anything, I could use like a re-standing rear guard or something. You know what? We could use something that re-stands. Or PG. That's also good too. Pretty damn good. Pretty damn good. So, let's get into it. This is gonna be a cool little battle. Aqua Force, of course, just nice and strong. And we're gonna see some new blue Asha potentially here as well. Which is pretty exciting. I haven't actually played against it yet. All right, we got a restanding rear and another tactics, which is also nice. We'll call the uh, thingamajig right here. Yeah, Overlord does um, bypass resist, which is a little bit annoying because it removes circles. Satch. <laughs> but Overlord hasn't been as common on ladder lately because everyone's playing like uh, like Heritage and stuff and like Fish. I actually haven't played too much ranked since Fish came out, so. I'm not too uh, aware of what fish meta is in uh, freaking Zero, so it'll be nice to go up against Blue Shell. Ooh, the draw trigger. Very nice. Big hand. Love to see it. Damn! The heal to break the one to pass. All right, bro. I see how it is. Oh my god, my hand is a little bit too big. My spoon is too big. All right. Look at top five, call one. Where will it be called? Will it be a resist card or will it be a not resist? It is not a resist, okay. Please don't overdraw anything important. That's fine. That's actually okay. Uh, so, we're going second, which means our first ride will be nice and strong with a race stand and stuff. I guess we can ride you and then call out the resist to the side here. Um, we're not getting our stuff removed, so I can might as well just call the tactics to the side here as well. Just to like take out the rears. We'll scale and push down the line. I just don't want to overdraw here again. Somehow still hitting heals and stuff. We do need some CB for our first stride turn, so I don't want to overdo it. All right. One damage has been put back in. We're both on one again. And now here comes the blue shot. Damn. Damn. All right. I've seen this animation like once before. But it's uh, quite interesting. All right, I'm gonna call out a blue shot on the rear. Stop healing! I, I actually need CB. <laughs> I'm gonna restart my stuff if you. If you oh my god, she's gonna damage the eye. How dare you? You're on zero as well. What's going on, Mr. Zero? Stop! I know this this game is called Vanguard Zero, but we don't have to take it so seriously, bro. Why so serious? Why so serious? All right, let's go, Mr. Sir Alexandria. Oh my God, the right chance don't stop. It's like an endless chain. Okay. Oh my God. All right. We need one CB for the stride itself. Uh, we might as well give Title Assault the counter charge, I guess. Um, that's uh, pretty good. Pretty good. I think. Yeah, we'll give Title Assault the resist here, not the counter charge, the resist. And, hmm, I'm trying to think how I want to build the rest of this board. kind of want to keep the Benedict for later because it's not going to connect here anyway, so I guess we'll just call this out. Hmm. Do I go for a whiffing attack? I guess I might as well go for a whiffing attack. This is compulsory too, so it's like I have to like whiff that one on purpose. It's kind of annoying. Hmm. Yeah, we'll call out the Algos here, and we'll with this column, and then just bash this so we get the wave skill off. Oh, I guess no, I technically didn't need to because this guy's wave two, but I guess it's for the wave four on this side. Okay, nice. The draw here helps a lot. Algos tack this together and settle for three hits to face. Yeah, potentially, but it is fine. It is no issue, no no worries, no problem. We will just swing three times to the face here, and 
get big power out of it. Is this wave four onwards? Oh yeah, wave four onwards, okay. So we can swing this first, and then we'll restand. All right, 26, no problem, I think. If it is a problem, please help. <laughs> no, it's no problem. Still hits, and we get the draw too. Excellent. And we draw into a PG. Very good, all right. So I put resist there, but it's not really gonna do too much. And then next turn, when we do the stride again, it's gonna be even more power. Yay! Excellent. All right. Asha gonna do her thing. Bot decking stuff and uh, Colin stuff. This is the back row attacker, isn't she? Yeah, she can attack from the back row if you discard one, and then she distributes power and stuff. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. Gonna go into the Dieta. Let's see. What did Dieta do again? CB1, G Persona. Um, put a card from head to soul, and then she gets all the names of the cards in your soul, and then you copy her uh, equal to the amount of cards face up in G zone plus one. And if you have two or more cards in G zone face up, then for that turn, all you just get plus 3k. Feels like you don't really need that power too much, so I guess it's pretty, pretty good overall. This is my first time playing against Blue Asha, like, legit. I have not played against this deck the whole time it's been out. And it's been, like, two months, I think? So, um... Sure is an experience. Alright, let's see, Rieta. Gonna clone some resists. It don't matter. The resists don't matter. Because... Mine are stronger. I will bash you more times. Alright, big power coming through. Give me a CB, that's all I really want. And all I've ever wanted. Sitting in the basement playing Dota. Alright. Swing at the rear. Diff blue, that's right. Get those Asha emotes. We should get a blue one. A blue Asha. Heart emoji. Oh, title assault. Goes to the grave. Checks the big draw. Can you check a big stand though? Oh, does check the big stand. Shree! Shree! Alright, that means I'll get some CB. CB! Lawnick! Exciting. Nice! Hit all the draws. Into a stride photo. I can actually use Benedict then. Sweet! Very good. Very good. Alright. In that case, we go for another Alexandros. As you can see, this deck has become very much one tone. <laughs> There is not much, like, customization to your plays. You just do the one thing that the deck is good at and keep doing it forever. Very good. Draw into more PGs. I don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do, indeed. Uh, I'll put this here. Shoop. Shablong. Kind of want to use Eric a little bit. Kind of want to use Eric and then just Benedict. I think I'll run out of CB. I might as well just use, like, double Adelaide, I think. Part of me wants to use this guy, but... Uh, I'll keep Eric in the back. Should have put Eric to the rear, actually, considering this board setup. But, oh well, it is what it is. It's okay. I don't want to be calling my PGs against the deck that hits, like, a bajillion numbers anyway, so... Yeah, let's use the Adelaide here. Don't mind if I do. All right, cool. It's a shame that she loses the 2k when she restands. I don't get that. It makes no sense. Make it make sense, bro. But it's okay. We'll hit some big triggers and have a grand old time. Here they come, my big triggers. I mean, uh, oh my God, where are my big triggers, bro? Come on. You were supposed to show me the big triggers. All right. We're not gonna need these Lambrokes to this extent. Big old standy. I've already hit them all. That's a lie. How dare you lie to me? No, you can't hit it there. That means my freaking thing doesn't hit anymore. Oh, no. All right, it's okay. We will rip out the hand. We rip out the hand on this turn a little bit. And the next turn, we do a little, we do a little fist bump. A little mah and we're good. Use Galapina for CC, good G-Guard. True, true. I'll, I'll Galapina next turn, bro. Just you wait. They turbo die next turn? That's right. Unless they, like, 
quick penta heal penta heal but they don't have any heals left all they have is pgs so i hope they have enough pgs to survive otherwise i win but yeah let's see i guess i could also just be calling like using thavas to call stuff to back row hmm are they using what's coming now nope there's no news on the future of zero um and they usually don't announce it until the very end of the month anyway so it'll be interesting to see what they say i mean technically we have zero cs next week and this week like tomorrow and also next week there's zero cs where i feel like they might announce the future of the game um whether it's going to v series or whether it's um getting getting blasted in the freaking head so i guess we'll see global has a cs coming up too so it can't die that easily, that's for sure. So let's see. They're going for a Verano. Verano! What will they Verano do? Still in main phase. Putting stuff back. Alright, you can stop putting stuff back now. No, you put a heal back! That's not good. That's not good. Did you do it again? Well, good thing you didn't, because if you did, I would be upset. Better not put no more heals back, bro. I'll be a little bit in your meow. All right, let's see those rears, bro. Let's see those rear guards. I'm ready. I'm ready. All right, big power. I don't think he's unlocked the back row attack on those units yet, though. All right, big power. All right, gonna ditch one, get that cool back row attack. Let's go. I'm gonna get the cool mighty Kiko coming through with the 21 months as well. Let Zero be in eternal format for a few months. This shit's been moving too fast. I agree. I would honestly be quite happy if they just let Zero like just be in its current state for a bit. Am I dead? Is there a dead angle here? I'm hitting like no triggers, so like I have three PGs. If he hits three stands, I die. If he hits two stands, I'm fine. Okay, that's just one stand. This is pretty close, actually. Okay, no stand. Okay, one stand. One stand is okay. I'm gonna give it to the back. That's fine. I get a counter charge out of this. That's pretty good. Which means I can do more combos. Exciting. Very good. Yeah, give people time to build decks. Yeah, dude. That'd be swell. Oh, he top decks the Strife Fighter like a god. Well, how does he do it? How is he built? Like a Roblox. That's crazy. I cannot believe it. Oh, I cannot believe it. Oh, I cannot believe it. Oh my god. So good. Alright, well. Let's do a little back row attack resist shenanigan. And a half. Very cool. We'll give you resist. And you can attack from the back. Very cool. Oh my god. So swag. Okay. Um, I don't have any, like, counter-blasting restanders. So I could technically use this. But then I can't use the... Never mind. My brain doesn't work. <laughs> Forget everything I said. It don't work like that. Alright. We back to the rear. Hoopshoo! And now, we bash from the back. I guess I can technically draw here. Theoretically. I can draw here. Oh, into another stride folder. Excelente. Huh? Why did you guys say, uh oh? But I have one CB. Huh? Oh, it's wave 2-3! Shaisemon! Ah! Crap! I can't read! Shit! I'm sorry. <laughs> I didn't mean that. I'm probably dead. <laughs> I even said to be careful because it's wave two and three. <laughs> and then I made my own mistake. 
<laughs> it wouldn't be a zero video if it wasn't me throwing. <laughs> oh. oh my god. How does this happen? No, it's gonna have crit everywhere. I'm gonna die. No, well, why did it have to be like this? Uh, dude, I had it. I literally had it. This could be a blooper. No one's gonna be part of it. We own up to our mistakes. We face our fears. If we shoot ourselves in the foot, we show everyone how we bleed. That is part of life. You do not run, you do not hide. If you fuck up, you own it. That's that's the way that's the way it is. We do not cut it in post. We will own up to our mistakes and we will cry blood. Cry blood for the people. PG and die. Alright. It's okay, I'll just sack a heal. I have one still, right? No, I don't. Yes! God damn it! I hate this game. Zero sucks, man. <laughs> How could this happen to me? I wasn't supposed to lose. I had it in the bag. <laughs> How nice of you to give him a free win to your opponent, dude. Yeah, dude, I just, I just felt like, you know, if I'm always like winning and like, like freestyling on everyone, it's like, nobody's gonna have fun, right? So sometimes you gotta, you gotta Twitch act a little bit. You gotta Twitch act, let some people get a win or dub or two here and there on a Monday or on a Tuesday, sometimes on a Saturday and let the people, uh, let the people have a little bit of a, have a little bit of a leeway, have a bit of a, Dub time is a, is a good time. Give people the dubs that they deserve. All right, Shinken Shobu, bro. Link Joker, never heard of her. Resist every day, bro. Going second, it's that easy. All right, here we go. This is gonna be a good game. Oh, look at that. Look at that opener. No problem, bro. No mulligan, bro. So nice. All right, what version of Link Chokers is gonna be? It's gonna be Chaos. Ain't no way it's anything else. Resist Force should be pretty well positioned here. Okay, it's the Messiah Stride Fodder. Maybe it's not Chaos. Maybe it's some original concoction. Ooh, we draw the Stride Fodder. Exciting news. Breaking news, even. All right. Whip. We do have to use Eric in this matchup, though. Because we don't want to have like a board of board of stuff chilling that gets locked and dies. All right, it does look like Star Vader's probably just playing like extra Stride Fighters, I guess. Gonna swing Van, gonna check nothing, and I'm gonna check a draw. Check it out. Shit. <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh. Samogu Sugoma. All right. We can go into mm, Algos, actually. We need rears that can hit on their own. Gonna use this to find ourselves a Thos. That's pretty good. And then just swing past. Very good. So we're gonna ride the Thos. Oh, my stop! Everyone's healing too much. I don't like that. What? Why, why did this become a healing game all of a sudden? So next time we're gonna go for a cool little resist gameplay, bro. All right, goes into the close. What are we closing? The door, I hope. It's cold outside. Heal we go again, that's right. <laughs> that is correct. All right, strange dragon. Why is he so strange? What strange acts has he done? What has he done that is so strange? Ooh, PG to bottom. Don't mind if I do? Look at that draw. So good, yeah. Does this hit? No, it doesn't. Ha <laughs> ha. All right. Here we go, bros. Big restand in the club. Big restand in the club. Hmm. That being said, I have a lack of resisting. Actually, no, I guess I can set up two resists. 
so it's fine. I can't really commit to greater ones, which is somewhat annoying. I guess I can afford to not have something in the back row. Kind of sad, but like, I can do, I can technically afford to have a locked back row. Because it's not like he'll, because he like set up locked back row anyway later down the line, right? He'll force lock stuff. So, we accept that factoid. We accept that little factoid. And uh, we're gonna just call out Adelaide and give a resist, I guess. You can have a little resist, though. You're not gonna use your skill, though. And you can have a little resist, though. Wave 2 3, bro. That's right. Don't forget, guys. I know you guys always forget the wave 2 to 3. Me, I never forget. And if you've ever heard anyone tell you that I forget, they were lying to you. That's made up. You know, AI technology is really scary these days. AI technology kind of fucked up. They try to make it seem like you said things and you did things that you never did. It's scary, bro. It's scary. You should really be careful. AI is, is coming for you. No! No, oh, that's the wrong one! Shit! Have it! Ah! <laughs> Stop this plague! Challenge! Challenge! Uh, unbeaten, <laughs> unbe unbeatable Among Us 3 AM challenge. <laughs> Oh. oh, well, well, well. If it isn't the consequences of my own actions. <laughs> oh, dear. It's okay. No problem. No problem. This is for the Zero Kids. Zero Kids have been having a really tough time lately. They don't know the future of their lives how could you live if you didn't know the future of your life but zero kids have to live like that they have to live without knowing the future of their lives and despite that that's zero kids zero future it's crazy and because they cannot know the future of their lives they have to find joy in other forms and I am that joy. I will bring you joy. I will make you laugh through my misplays. I will bring joy and laughter to the Zero Kids. I will refuse to give in to despair. We have to save the Zero Kids. Do not let them be sad. Because the Zero Kids being sad means my opponent starts healing. As you can see, it's not, not, not good. <laughs> Please don't do it again. That would be appreciated. Nice. Excellent. Excellent. Now, if I could, like, uh, get, like, a counter charge. Shit, dude. Huh? What was this? Uh, blah, 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 blah. They may call one. If you don't, you draw one. Okay, you can have a card. Yay! Mr. Algosh. Dude, my hand sucks. Um. Hmm. My hand sucks, dude. My hand sucks. But my scaling is like... Woo -hoo -hoo. So I think... We go for the scaling option. Yeah, Dubnium is a little bit of a susia bogus. Oh? Alright, 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 alright. I like that. I don't like that my front row is going to get locked, though. Not a fan of that one. Quite literally not a fan. Yeah, I think I'm gonna call you down. Not gonna use your skill. Man, it sucks, man. I kind of have to just accept the fact that I will. I kind of have to high roll. Shlium. Mm See, this time I can't misplay. Can I heal twice? No, just once is fine, actually. I'm on three. <laughs> Can I check triggers? That, that might be a good surprise. Surprise! Kinder surprise! Alright. The Animal Crossing beat. Going kind of hard. Big power. Excelente. Don't hit another trigger. You! 
God damn it! Stop hitting triggers! Why is everyone so lucky? <laughs> Why is everyone so lucky when my brain is at 30% capacity? Stop! I'm trying to win. I want to win her. It's so sad. I don't like it. I don't like it. It's not great. Alright. Please don't do anything crazy. Oh no, that's kinda crazy. You're little, you're being a little crazy right now. What's your what's your vanguard? Okay, it's not crisis. <coughs> At least it's not crisis. That means I don't have to be in the crisis. If you use your starter though, I will start crying. Uh-oh. I don't like that. That's not good. Please don't. Stop right now. Put that to the damage. Put the front row to the damage, please. Misclick and put the front row to the damage, please. Please put the front row to the damage. I beg and Of course, don't. All right. Can you attack my walk unit? Can you like... Are you gonna damage? You're gonna heal deny yourself? Okay, good, 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 good. Don't mind if don't mind if you do. Don't mind if you do. Don't mind if you do. That's great. All right. I need a big top deck right now. I need the guy top deck into like the world. Okay, you can keep drawing cards. That's that's fine. Yeah. Is that a counter charge? No, it's not. God damn it. All right, here comes the top deck. Fuck you, dude. No! Leave me alone. I don't like you. My mom said I can't play with you. Put it behind Vanguard. No! Can't do anything with this. Dude, why? Th th this is supposed to be my matchup, dude. I was supposed to win this, like, easy style. But now I'm losing epic style instead. That's, that's like, not... Not really what I signed up for. <sighs> Attack Rigor with Tavas. And then what? Die? <laughs> huh. I might actually have to just build time. I have one heal in deck. Dude, this sucks. I have three PGs in deck. That means if I stride, I might find it up the top. Man. This sucks. Just hit OT. I'm about to hit the stop streaming button. <laughs> Shit. You know what? No striding. Go to battle. Fuck off. <laughs> uh, there was a PG up top. Draw into PG. Draw into the strike. I don't know, man. This sucks. <laughs> I don't know what to do. My life is falling apart in my hands. My life is falling apart in my hands. The chat is judging me. I just paid $4,000 for my new apartment moving in fees. And chat is judging me while I try to play with semen. <laughs> I die. I die. This is not fun. I'm never recording another Zero video ever again. This is it. This is the last Zero video I've ever made. I hope you're happy. You did this to yourself. You did this to yourself. The end of Zero. I'm not saving Zero anymore. Oh, 07. Can you deck yourself out, bro? That'd be like super Gangnam style. That'd be like turbo Gangnam style. Oh seven, bro. Oh seven. It's okay. I'll just hit the heal, dude. Just hit the heal on six. Next turn, we do big stride, Gangnam style, all over the place. It's gonna be crazy. I got the perfect setup. Just need to hit the cool little heal, and that's all I need to do. It's gonna be great. Incoming. Check it out. It's right here, on the top of my 16 card deck. Here's a heal trigger. Fuck this game, man. I'm not recording anymore. <laughs> That's the video. I don't give a shit. I don't fucking care. <laughs> I don't care anymore, dude. Zero sucks. All right, well, that's all. I hope you enjoyed this video. A great little showcase. I hope you had a little fun with watching it. I hope you had a great time with uh, with with uh, Mr. Alexandros. Don't forget, wave two and three. 
Uh, if you could play this deck better than me, tell me in the comments, because um, I'm, I'm sure nobody can. I'm the best Thomas player that ever existed. And um, if you like this video, give it a like. If you've never liked my videos before, please start liking them from today and go back and like every single one of them that I've ever posted. Also, subscribe to my second channel. Also, follow my Twitter. Also, check out my Facebook page. Also, follow me on Reddit. Also, join my Discord channel. And if you're not using your Twitch Prime on my Twitch channel, you should better use it right now because, goddammit, dude, I'm going to lose my mind. Anyway, thank you for watching this video. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.